I was watching the BBC version of North and South, my favourite period drama, um, and I was really inspired by Margaret's hairstyles. So I'm going to try and recreate that in a really simple way because I'm a mum I don't have a lot of time, as I'm sure a lot of you are as well. Um, everyone's a bit time poor, so I don't have time to style my hair or, um, you know, I never blow dry, ever, like maybe twice a year. I'm really shopping like that. So um, it's a very, very easy way to do it. So what you need to do is part your hair in the middle, and I've done this side already, but I'm going to show you how to do this other side. If you just part, make it into two sections here. Now the first section, you just need to get a hairband, and I'll use really small black ones, so you can't see them. Uh, you can just get them from Priceline or you know Coles, and you can get them pretty much anywhere. Just make it into a loose picky. And then what you need to do is part in the middle and twist the piggy back through like this. Okay, I'm going to do the same with this section. Just a loose piggy. Part in the middle. Twist through. Okay, now what you need to do with the back is just simply plait it for now. Um, just before you, you gather your hair up, it's just a good idea to twist the excess of these if you can. Don't worry, it's, it's actually not a big deal if you don't want to, but um, it just, just sort of creates a little bit more texture, I guess. Um, so I'm just going to twist these parts here before I plait them. And then I'm going to draw them back into my hair into a plait. Okay. That's all pretty rough. Let's just gather it all up into a plait. And just plait it all the way down to the ends. Now if you've got really thick hair, it will look especially beautiful on you. My hair is quite thin, but I've got a lot of it, but it's very straight. Okay, so I've just plaited it. Now what I'm going to do is curl it into a bun like this. And once I've done that, I'm going to roll it up into itself like this. Just roll it up like that. Once you've got that, just put some bobby pins into where you rolled it up so you can't see them. You need about three or four, depending on the thickness of your hair. Okay, that's pretty secure for me. Now what I've got, I bought um, a just a Christmas flower decoration from Lincraft. You can get them from discount stores, and I'm going to put that in. So we can't see from behind, but you get the gist of what it looks like. And that's what it looks like from the side. It's any little bits like this are very easy to just to tuck, tuck in with a few bobby pins. And there we are, what do you think? Does he think it looks... Um, I'd probably, with this, I'd probably get a bobby pin. And I've run out here. But I'd probably get a bobby pin. Take one of these out. 
and just pin it with one of the stems back onto my head just to hold it fast. Do you think it looks period drummerish? I hope so. Hope you enjoy. I'm going to do a makeup um, to match this in a sec too.